hello everyone and welcome to a new video in today's video i'm going to teach you guys how you can allow users to download your wordpress posts as pdfs to their phone using just a free and simple plugin in wordpress and we're starting just now okay so first and first what we need to do is to log into our admin dashboard and while we are inside our admin dashboard you need to come down to plugins and add new now we're going to search for a plugin called print my blog so this is a plugin we're going to be installing it has over 5000 active installations and it has been updated four days ago so we're going to install now and we're going to activate okay so the plugin has been installed and activated we're going to um see this welcome screen but we don't need anything here i'm actually going to show you how you can use just one feature of this plugin which is to allow users to download your wordpress posts as a pdf so what we're going to do is to come down to settings okay so here we're going to see two options here it said show prints button on either posts or pages we're going to choose posts and then we're going to open this customized button so where do you want to place the button we want to place the button below the content so when they finish reading the post they can then download it as a pdf to their phone so if you want to deactivate the print and ebook option you can do that but for this tutorial i'm just going to leave it there but we're going to edit the pdf option so we're going to click on show options all right so what are the content you want to appear on the pdf we're going to leave site title we're going to leave the tagline we're going to leave the site url everything is pretty cool like that if you also want to show um give credits to this plugin you can also add that tagline there that um this was created with prince my uh, my blog plugin so we can just leave everything as it is okay post content on print we're going to activate author and url just for the sake of this tutorial you can do whatever you um feel like the one that works well for you so the next one we're going to check is the page layout each post begins on a new page uh we're going to tick that option for um for this um for this tutorial columns one font size normal we're going to leave everything as it is and we're going to check the troubleshooting options okay it says post rendering with time milliseconds to wait before rendering posts if posts are rendered too quickly on the page sometimes image won't load properly so we're just going to add 1000 ms just to make everything work fine all right so we're done with this setting so all these settings also um they are also applicable to other options but we're not going to we're not going to do everything one after the other you can just use the same knowledge of this um pdf option to fix the other options too if you're interested in using them so we're just going to edit the text and then we're going to um, say something like um download as pdf so they can know that this button is actually going to download the page um the post as a pdf so when we're done we're just going to click on save settings all right so you said settings saved you should see the changes on your latest post so we're just going to check our latest post now all right so this is the post this is one of the posts on our website so we're going to scroll down all right we can see it's here um the print option the download as pdf option and then the ebook option so we're going to click download as pdf um our page is ready um so we can see the size title the site tag, tag line and we can see the more details about um these posts and then they can just click on print to pdf all right so the next thing you can just do is to click on print and it's going to download as a pdf so this is um, how you can allow users to convert your wordpress posts um, into pdf that they can read later on offline on their phone without you know without actually coming back to your website or opening their mobile browser to read such posts so thank you for watching this video if you um, really learned something in this video make sure you to leave a like if you have any problems make sure to drop your comments in this comment section down below and if you want to see more awesome contents like this don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications so you'll be notified anytime i release a new video until next time peace